Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you all so very much for joining me today. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Today's video, I'm super excited about. I purchased a huge sheen haul, a very, very huge sheen haul, which I'm going to break into different parts. So this is one part of that video. Um, now I've got so much stuff to show you. I'm so, so excited. But like I said, guys, this is a sheen video. I have taken to Sheen like a duck to water. <laughs> I love the site. I think a lot of the, um, if you guys haven't used Sheen before, it's an online um, site that you buy. You can buy pretty much anything. Um, clothes, little smalls. Um, and I have a couple of these to show you today. We've got some clothes and some smalls that I've bought. Um, and you can earn points if you check in every day. And you also get tons of vouchers. So, this is some of the stuff that I've purchased um, in my huge, huge haul. And I'm going to start by showing you the little things. Um, I'm going to show you these. These are cute and adorable. These are little lollipop face cloths. They are so adorable. The only thing I don't like is the fact that they put the sticker on the front um, of the lollipop, but I generally tend to open these. I've purchased them before and I turn them around because they look better, um, but these are adorable. These little items, and I have my order. So I want to let you guys know, first and foremost, I got a discount because I used my discount code when purchasing this order. That's the reason I bought such a big order. Plus, I used my points. So, I'm going to tell you the original price for these. These little items were 60p an item, which I think is, is really cheap. And with my points and my discount count, I got them for 40p each. So, I'm going to show you guys what these are. So, I love the fact that they are decorated. They're wrapped up like little lollipops. And you open them up. And this is what you get. You get a little lollipop. Um, I love the fact that they go to the extreme and they color the little popsicle sticks, which is lovely. You just pull the popsicle stick away. It takes also takes the sticker. And then you have this. That is so cute. We don't use that. But we have this microfiber face cloth. Um, I use these face cloths quite often to um, remove my makeup. They're great makeup removers, but I also use them for cleaning. Um, so to get this little cloth for 40p, when it looks as cute as this, um, and I tend to buy a lot of these and then I pop them into the little charity bags um, when I do my Christmas charity um, haul. So I really, really love these. And I mean, it's a decent sized cloth. It will clean your face and they're just, I mean, they're kitty um, cloths. So they're really stinking cute, but I'll use this one for cleaning. Um, but I was super, super excited about that. Guys, another thing, I've been getting into doing my nails a lot. I go through periods, phases, I guess, where I will do lots of fun things with my nails. I go through periods where I don't do anything with my nails. I'm in um, a real... I'm in a real kind of do my nails and be fancy type of mode. I don't like to pay expensive prices to have my nails done in a salon. I generally tend to do things at home that I can do. And these are my nails today. The reason I'm showing you my nails today is because I purchased. Where is the order for this? I purchased a number. If I can find them. I purchased a number of nail stickers. I like to do things quick. Um, I don't like to hang around when I'm doing my nails. These are, I think, upside down. Um, so I purchased some nail stickers um, so I can paint my nails and then pop a sticker on, put some top coat over the top and just have fancy nails um, quickly, I guess. And I really like these because the original price on this, again, was 60p and I got it for 40 with my discount code and also with my points. Now, let me show you guys. It's hard to see. Um... But these are little Chinese symbols and um, dragon um, stickers. And I popped, I did open these. Um, I did take a section from the bottom. You get a full sheet and I used some for my nails. I'm not really quite sure what these symbols mean. Hopefully they don't mean anything silly. But I really, really like them. Um, so I popped those on. 
um, just for this video actually because I wanted to show you guys um, just how fun these little things can be. I um, painted my nails with a nail hardener to start off with, then a um, coat of red, then I put the sticker on and you can just pop these off really, really easily using a pair of tweezers. Be careful, they are delicate. Um, I did break a couple that's fine um and then i put um a top coat over this thing this set of nails i haven't done the top coat on this set yet but i will and i think they came out pretty nice um so for 40p i thought that was awesome i also purchased another two sets and again guys these were 60p and i got them for i got them for 40p which is awesome i got these little nail arrows and glitzy nail tips which i am so excited to use i might even do um, a decoration on these um, nails the nails that i haven't done i'm not sure yet but i think these are so cute and then i bought this one these ones are more sheeted so you will have to cut them to size i'm totally fine with that um, I wanted something a little different and this is actually the side I should be showing you. They are like silver detail, if you can see. Um, and I just thought this would be fun to add a little different dimension to my nails. So I will let you guys know <coughs> in the description um, if I've used um, any of the other nail items. Um, and I'll let you know how that went. Um, to continue on with the small things... I thought these were really good. These little nail files, I love. I do love, I don't mind an emery board, but I prefer, um, I prefer to use the, um, the metal style ones. I think, just think they get down the side of my nails much better and give me a better shape. Um, and they're really sturdy, really, really, really good. Let's pop this open. If I can get it open, come on. This is a huge bag for such a tiny little product. Um, I would have went with a much smaller bag, but it is a little mini nail file. Um, and I bought two of these. I bought, you get, these are random colors, so you can't actually select these. Um, they just come as you order them. Um, and I got these two pretty colors and I'm really, really happy about. These nail files were 25p and with my discount and my points, I got them for 20p a nail file. They are fantastic. Um, they are really rigid on one end and softer on the other. So you can really get in and take a lot of that nail off that you don't want. And then you can soften it and buffer it out. But I thought these were pretty cool for the price. And um, so I decided to buy two and I was elated when I got them for 20p. I'm going to pop both of these in the same bag. Um, so if you guys like a metal nail um, file, it's slightly um, smaller, so it's a mini um, nail file. These are definitely a thumbs up for me. What other small things have we got? Oh, more nail stuff. So this is a little nail tape or section. I don't really know what this was called. Let me see. Did I Do I have this? on my order do, 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 do. i have it somewhere guys i have my um other phone and i'm just checking the order to see if i can find this okay so this is called a nail line art decoration um and this only cost me 20p it was 25p as well and it only cost me 20p and i bought this because again i'm really kind of getting so interested in doing my nails and doing different kind of like styles with my nails um and just I guess three sets of packaging crazy um and just I guess um I want to I want to test and try out what I can do so this is just a little separator so what I want to do is do a pattern on my nail do one color um one side one color and one side another color this is super super thin I am not even sure if I know how to use this but for 20p let's see I don't even know how to open it. For 20p, I definitely thought it was worth a shot. Um, I mean, if I don't use it or it's not what I expected it to be, I don't even know if that's where it opens. If it's not what I expect it to be, I mean, that's totally fine because it was 20p. And so I'm not really going to be that worried. I really don't know how to open this. But I'll give you guys an update in the... Um, 
in the description and let you know um, how fun I think this is. I mean, guys, if you are a nail tech or, you know, you're doing nails for your friends or whatever, Sheen is a really, really good place to find some cheap, inexpensive products um, that, you know, means that it's not going to cost you a fortune to do your nails or if you just want to have fun and experiment. I definitely think that's it's awesome. I always need tweezers. I don't seem to understand where my tweezers go to. I put a pair down and then I lose them. And um, the last pair that I bought, I got from Pineland. They were a pound, which I still think was an awesome bargain. But I got these black ones. I like the fact that they come with a little, um, a little silicone connector that keeps them together. But these originally were 50p with my discount and my my discount code and my points. I got them for 40p. I love these wide um, tweezers. I think they're excellent for getting right into um, my eyebrows and, and allowing me to really be precise about where I pluck. Um, so I'm really, really stoked that I have these. Probably not super exciting to you, but they are to me. And for 40p, I think I got a bargain. So I'm super, super happy with that. I'm not even putting those back in again because I'm probably going to use them. So guys, again, I told you I'm really kind of like doing my nails and being kind of a little bit weird about it. And I, I just bought so many nail products. So these are little nail covers. I think that's what they're called. Let me check my order. Um, do I have them? These are called a five piece nail polish remover clip. These originally were 70, 75p. These were originally 75p with my discount. Where did that go? With my discount and my points, I got them for 59p. And I don't really do gel polish, but I do find that sometimes when I wear glitter nail polish, oh, I hate using pads to scrub it off because it takes forever. So what my thinking was, because you get a set of five, and I usually only, um, I usually ha only have glitter nail polish on one or two of my nails, so this is perfect for me. Um, what I was thinking was that I could use a little bit of gauze, put some nail polish remover on it, and then put it put the clip on and just allow it to sit and soak up and really eat into that glitter it's going to make it a 10 times easier for me to um to get the nail polish with the glitter off i just find it tedious trying to rub it out um so i'm really really excited about these look how cute they are so it says nail you have this clip at the top they are super comfortable to wear there's no pinching they fit my thumb and just make sure they fit all of my nails. These fit perfectly. And they're all one sized. So I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, it doesn't really matter how I have chubby fingers. It doesn't matter, matter if you've got slim fingers or chubby fingers or whatever. Um, they're definitely going to fit because they are just one size. And I think these are going to be so invaluable. Um, I'm super excited I have these. I am going to put these into a little bag and I will put them into my that bag totally broke um I will put these into my little um nail I have a little nail case where I keep all of my nail items that I buy all my nail polishes my removers um I keep all of my stickers I'm definitely going to use these uh, guys I will be using this probably before the end before this video goes up so I will definitely let you know how this works the other thing that I purchased, let's pop our wee things over here. The other thing that I purchased is, I don't know about you guys, but I have a real issue with her being stuck in my hair brushes. I try really, really hard to get the hair out. Um, and what I tend, what I was using was an old comb to just brush through the hair brush. But I saw this on Sheen. Let me just check on my orders, the price of this. Um, I saw this and it was cheap, cheap. This was, again, originally 75p. I got it for 59p. And it is called, it is called a one-piece hair brush cleaner. It comes in black and it's one size. Um, it is very mini, though. <laughs> Let me show you guys. So it is this little black tool, just 
plastic at the bottom with these um metals not very very sturdy but you're not going to go too hard anyway so that's fine and um, but they've got these metal spikes at the top with little hooks and you rake it through your hairbrush and it pulls out all of the hair i don't have my hairbrush on hand i really wish i had brought it for this video but i forgot this little item was here so i will update you guys and let you know how this works but i am so excited to have it because i really really hate her being in my hairbrush i like a nice clean hairbrush so for 59p i am super super happy so guys that's all the little smalls that i have for this video now i want to show you what i'm really really excited about i purchased clothes from sheen i wouldn't say i purchase them all the time but i purchase them often enough um and sometimes sheen is excellent and i would absolutely say true to size and then sometimes it can be a little weird so um i did i did try all these items on i unfortunately didn't take photographs of me in them but i am going to put in one of the corners i am going to put the picture from this the site so that you guys can see what it's like but i have some hits and some misses here um we've only got three pieces of clothing um in this part of the haul I will show you more um when I do the next video but let me go ahead and start with the first item so the first item didn't come in the normal sheen bag um you guys know that most times sorry just trying to do a tiny bit of clear up just to create a bit of space we'll pull all that stuff to the side so the first thing that I purchased which I I guess it was my fault I didn't read the description I thought when I purchased this top that it was uh, a jersey top. It isn't. It is. Let me see if we can find out what material it is. It is polyester and elastine. So it's a polyester top, which is what I kind of thought it was. It is still a super pretty top. But it's just not the top that I thought it was going to be. So let me try and organize this top. So this top has this pretty little motif. And this top on the site is called a plus sized heart and gesture print not shoulder tee. Yeah, it says tee on it. Then why did I think it was going to be a jersey? I don't know. You guys look at the photo that I've popped up and let me know if you think it looks like a jersey top um but it was still a bargain originally they said this top was 10.99p and with my points and my discount and it being on sale i got it for three point three pound three pound 89p so i'm really not i'm really not too disappointed because of the price point i don't know if i'll keep this top i might put it in a giveaway or I might put it in the charity bag. I'm not sure what to do with this t-shirt. So when you get this top originally, you just tie the little knots at the top, and that is to suit your shoulder. And it is just this black top. It is um it does slightly come off the shoulder, and this is your other strap. Um you'll see a better picture um in the um the pop-up that I put up but I mean it's not bad it's long sleeved it's okay it's just polyester something I'm not a lover of um but I'm not disappointed I'm, I am disappointed that's not true I am disappointed but I'm not devastated because it was less than four pound so that's totally fine and guys just as an FYI I got free shipping on this order because the order was over I think over 60 or 70 pound in total um so i got free shipping on that so if for the price that i'm telling you is the price i actually paid for this these, this stuff the next thing i purchased which i'm excited about is this adorable dress this dress is so pretty um i will put the picture up um it will either be up now or in and around when i'm showing you this item this is the cutest dress now this dress is very um i don't know what material this is either let me try and find the okay we've got more polyester and spandex <laughs> polyester and spandex there's there's no real give to this um for there being spandex in it this polyester is not the same as this one this one is a the black 
um, top is really, it's thicker. And um, even though it's see-through, it's thicker. It doesn't have that kind of flowiness to it, which this dress does. This dress is stunning when it's on. I'm going to show you guys a picture so you can see what it looks like on the, the website. And if I could find the top, that would be amazing. Um, this is the back. So this is a wrap over dress. And the top, I'm really not showing this off to the best of my ability. But it is, it's got this gorgeous frill that runs from the top right to the bottom of the dress you guys will see it in the picture it is absolutely stunning this um this little dress i wouldn't 100 percent say that it is true to size i think it's a tiny bit too small for me which is okay um but I do plan to lose weight. So I plan to get into this dress. But look how gorgeous these colors are. You've got this gorgeous red, the gorgeous um, black, the very Spanish type florally um, dress. And you guys will see the picture above. But let me tell you why I bought this dress. This dress was awesome. This is called a all over floral, knot tie, ruffle hem wrap dress. And um, it fully wraps around. You will find that when you are wrapping it around, you do have to look really carefully for the hole to push the um, to push the um, the belt through to make sure that it wraps. And that does take a bit of time, but it's still okay. This dress was originally fifteen pound. It was then on sale. Um, when I purchased it with my coins, with my points, sorry, and my um, voucher. Um, and you get vouchers all the time from Shane. So save up all your points until you get your voucher and use both to purchase your items. I got this gorgeous dress, gorgeous summer dress for £5.44p. I could not believe that I got that for that price. And guys, I'm not showing you this to its full potential, but you guys will have seen in the picture, if I've not put it up already, it will be on this segment of the video. The dress is stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, so I'm super, super excited about that. And the last item I'm so happy with as well. Again, guys, you will see um, the picture. I will put the, the picture from the site up because you don't get the full, you don't get the full effect when I'm sitting here telling you about it, but I'm, I'm super excited about it. This one, this top is called a gold zip up bomber jacket. I purchased this jacket in a size bigger because I always like bigger clothes. This, to me, was, would definitely be true to size. So if you were going to buy this jacket and you wanted it quite fitted, um, where it fitted your body shape, then definitely go for your size. With the dress, I would size up. With the top, um, I would. the top is definitely true to size. It's just the material that I don't like. The dress is definitely one size up. Um, you definitely need a one size up, but I don't care because I'm going to fit into that. And the, <laughs> the jacket is definitely true to size. However, I love my jackets. Um, I love my jackets big, baggy. The bigger, bigger, the baggier, the better is how I see it. I'm going to tell you something about this jacket. I was so happy with this. Um, I purchased this because of summer. I generally like to get a lot of summer clothes in so that I'm not waiting on the summer season to hit before I get some nice summer clothes. Um, so this jacket was £17.49p originally. It went on sale, um, but I don't know the sale price because I don't um, get to see the sale price. But the price that I paid for this with my points and with my voucher, um, I usually wait until I get the 15 percent voucher so I'm working on the premise that I got 15 percent on this order and free delivery and um, don't forget about that um I got this jacket for six pound and 98 p six pound 98 p that is awesome I'm going to move this stuff over to the side and let you see this jacket so this jacket is again I think this is also polyester but a really really nice a really nice polyester. It is 100% polyester. Um, I don't mind that in a jacket because I'll always have something underneath. This jacket is massive. I probably, in hindsight, wouldn't have went one size up with this jacket. I think this jacket, um, in hindsight, would be big if you bought it true to size. Um, now that I'm looking at it, because it is huge. 
I still don't mind that because I really love um, jackets. And I, I mean, coming into summer, I mean, I could wear this jacket with a jumper underneath and it's still going to be big and baggy. So that's fine for me. But it is a long, a <laughs> really long, let me show you guys. So it's a really, really long jacket. It's a long, really light um, bomber jacket. It goes on, it goes on, it goes on. But you guys will see more a better picture in um, the picture that I post um, from the actual site. There are, the only thing I don't like about this jacket is there are no pockets. I am a lover of pockets in everything, in dresses, in skirts, in trousers, in jeans. I love pockets, but I'm not mad. Um, it does have a little fake pocket. I thought that was a real pocket. It's not. Um, it does have a little fake pocket on the inside. But again, guys, in winter, if I'm going out or autumn, if I'm going out or spring, if I'm going out somewhere, um, what I like to do with a bomber jacket, because I already have one, but it's a bit old and tatted and it does need to go. But what I like to do with a bomber jacket is I like to put a hoodie underneath. So a black hoodie that has its own pockets. So I'm totally not mad at this. Um, I've put a picture or have already put a picture up somewhere um, to show you guys the full effect um, just so that you guys can see how cute and adorable these little clothes are. I do always think it's hit or miss sometimes with the size in dresses. I find I always need to size up and I should have done that with this um, Spanish type dress. The jacket I should have sized or went for my original size instead of sizing up, but I'm not mad at it. The top is completely true to size, but I just, it's, and I love the print and I love the tie. I just don't like the fabric and I don't genuinely believe I will wear it. Um, the sleeves are cute though. The sleeves are long and puffy and I really like this wide band at the bottom. Well guys, I really hope you liked this video. I always have a ton of fun buying things and sharing um, the things that I've purchased with you guys. It just gets me more excited for everything that I've bought. I really hope you guys love it too. If you do, let me know in the comments section below. That would be awesome. And I really hope you guys have an amazing day. If you're not yet a subscriber and would like to join us, come on ahead. We'd love to have you here. If you'd like to be notified of any of my future videos, don't forget about the notification bell. And um, guys, please, please, please do like the video. Every time you guys like um, and share my video, it really does help support my channel. Um, and I am actively trying to do better videos and actively trying to grow. So if you can definitely um, do those things for me, that would be amazing. Guys, please take care. Please stay safe and please look out for each other. I'm going to see you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye.